I'm tired and I'm sleepy. Let's go to fucking bed, you you assholes. You bitches. I killed... I've killed at least a thousand people. It's time for me to sleep now. In, the, in, in level two, chapter two, whatever you want to call it, you, you're, uh, the Bronco family is going to, to the nightclub. <clears throat> and they're going to do... They're going to party. It's party time. It's party time, motherfuckers! And, and, and you're supposed to protect them because, you know, some shit happened yesterday. Which begs the question, if they just witnessed a bunch of murder and, and, and death in front of them, why, why would they even want to go out at all? So they go into the club, and they open the door, and we're fucking shut up in here. You know, which I also tend to do on occasion. After, I, after I've had a couple, it's time, to, it's time to fucking do some roughhousing, son. As long as you keep pushing the space bar, you have unlimited bullet time unlike the other games uh, I'm not sure what I think about this but as long as you keep pushing that space bar you could pretty much do this all day watch and learn kids this is how you bullet time <laughs> ow 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 it hurts Max has a narcotics problem so he now resorts to asking random strangers for money hey let me hold tin I ain't got no money. Well, that's fine, that's fine. Just, just hit me on that cash app, bro. I like it when Max bullet times and slams into walls. Ow! But because Max is generally incompetent at his job, he gets Rodrigo's hot wife kidnapped and you gotta rescue her. Look at this shit. Bulletproof glass. Bulletproof glass. Hey, yo, what the fuck? I knew this was gonna be a bad idea, but in the continued absence of any good ones, I decided to go with it. Yeah, well, what if you don't, you like, don't do that and like, take the stairs or something? There's a on-rails shooting section in this level, which I really don't care for much. Basically, you take this rifle, and you gotta protect, uh, the sister, I forget her name. Who cares, anyway? Who cares? This section goes on for about three minutes, or more, which is way too long in my opinion, it should be more like 30 seconds. And you see, it's not that bad of a section when you first start the game out. It's not a bad way to keep you on your toes, it's actually kind of exciting. But after you've beaten the game, played the game all the way through about five times, you're like, oh damn, this shit again. Immediately following that section, you go through the exact same shooting gallery again, except this time on foot, which is, uh, which is fine. It's fine. It's fine. It's good. It's fine. It is also with great remorse that I inform you that the first death occurred on this playthrough. Shit. I was up for one god-awful performance review. Anyway, after you kill all those goons, you have to try and catch up to Giovanna again. And yeah, that's her name, by the way. It's Giovanna. Hey! No, nothing. Go. Seems like I wasn't the only guy around here who had taken his eye off the ball. Are you okay? My weakness was the ball. Passos was the, my ball. And part of me wished I was too. 